Hi, I'm Ron Koningsberg, President of American Investment Properties. Thanks for checking in to watch the February edition of our monthly video series. It's likely that you've heard of a 1031 exchange and may have even used a 1031 exchange to defer the payment of taxes on the sale of an investment property. But you may not have heard of a 1033 exchange. In today's video, we're breaking down 1033 exchanges. What is a 1033 exchange? A 1033 exchange is a useful tool to defer tax when a taxpayer loses property because of a casualty or condemnation. A 1033 exchange addresses involuntary conversions of real estate either through the condemnation of the real estate by a government entity using its eminent domain authority known as taking the property for public good or through the partial or total destruction of the real estate by a natural disaster such as fire, flood, hurricane, etc. where insurance proceeds are received. These two scenarios are both considered involuntary conversions that the real estate owner could not foresee. No intermediary necessary. Unlike a 1031 exchange, a 1033 exchange does not require a qualified intermediary at any point throughout the transaction. Proceeds received from an involuntary conversion do not have to be held by a third party as they do for a 1031 exchange. The real estate owner can take immediate possession and control of the funds in a personal account, money market, and investment accounts. Timing. The real estate owner has two years to reinvest the proceeds into a like-kind property if the involuntary conversion was the result of a natural disaster and three years to reinvest if it was a condemnation. In order for a 1033 exchange to be considered complete, a like-kind purchase must take place and title must be passed to the investor before the exchange deadline is up. Like-kind investment. A 1033 exchange is completed most often with the reinvestment of the forced conversion proceeds into a like-kind investment real estate. Like-kind simply denotes that investment real estate must be exchanged for investment real estate. Thanks for watching our February video on 1033 exchanges. We hope you found this information relative and interesting. As always, if you have any questions about the Long Island commercial real estate market, please contact me, Ron Koningsberg at American Investment Properties. Thank you.